Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Cave Johnson's Dead Man's Blunder from Sector 5 as requested by Dark Rose. And if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Really appreciate the support. But without further ado, let's jump into the description, which simply says, a new creation. Hope you enjoy and have fun. Dark Rose says, I helped him a little with this. Hopefully it's a little challenging. There are some strange aspects to the puzzle, but the core intended solution is well made. All right. Let's have a look, shall we? And laser collision is off. All right, so laser into here allows me to walk into places. And also gives me another cube. Okay. Can I take cubes through here? I can't remember if I can or not. I cannot. Alright. So. Do this again. Because. Uh, I lost my portals. Alright. We're safe. Uh, okay. So from here we can go over there or we can go over there uh, I would assume that going over here would be more beneficial Okay. It's a panel that we can flip. It's going to go into that. It's not signed though. Maybe it's. Uh... Okay. That allows us to go to there. Probably should have brought a cube with me here. And then I should have brought... Yeah, okay. So I should have brought the... I should have brought the laser cube across here with me. So let's just rewind quickly, just so we don't have to do that again. And let's do just that. I mean, I could have brought both cubes across with me if I'd have wanted. Oh wow, that's a, that's a booby trap. Yay! Alright, so... That's probably the first thing I don't like about the map. So if I'd have done that, okay, and then done this, it's going to block the connection. Hopefully I don't fall to a terrible, terrible death. Um. Wow, really? Jeez. You uh, want to be quite precise about this, don't you? Mr. Laser Catcher. Alright, third time's a charm. Third time is indeed a charm. Okay. That's, uh, that's all great. But I 
How do I get back? That's the big question. So maybe I just have to... I don't know, maybe I reset the puzzle. See, my biggest sort of, like, worry and concern is Once I come back over to here, I can't get over here. Because that is connected to that. No, it's all a bit weird. Minute. Let's um so doing that, let's just have a look over here. Let's see what happens when we connect the leg bone to the thigh bone. So yeah, I could have brought something here. I could have brought my laser cube here. Oh, we could have done that. We could get over to there. What else does that do? That must do something else. It can't just be like a booby trap. So... Take both of these. Is there another light bridge? I'm not seeing, no. But now I'm trapped. So that's not what you want me to do. My big question is, how do I get a cube on there? And then get back over to this side. Alright. Let's um, restart to a degree. 
may have seen something. Right, so, I think keeping this open is possibly the key. So instead of doing that, let's do this. And then... That's it. That's what I need to do. Then I can walk through here with this cube in place. And we go plink, plonk, tiddly bonk. That's in the night garden speak. And we're done. Alright, so it's actually really simple. I don't get the whole light bridge thing though. Why is that area a thing? Why booby trap the player? I just you're just kind of in, insinuating you want the player to kill themselves. Uh, I wouldn't have that in there at all. Makes no sense. Unless I solved it incorrectly. But yeah. Um well, no, pretty simple, but nice puzzle. Um, I kind of really overlooked the fact that I could fire the portal there and then manage that cube in there constantly open to stop that respawn from happening. So, quite clever in that aspect, but yeah, that middle section I would get rid of completely. Guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any matches you'd like to play, please leave in the comments or to my Google form. I'll link to that in the description. But until next time, I've been Knock, you've been awesome. See ya.